Day of Ukraine. So Jeff here and I'm here in Sam's Club. And we are checking out, of course, the latest tools and barbecue stuff and outdoor stuff and remodeling and clearance and TVs and security. Uh, so we're going to show you some pretty good deals here today. I wanted to start off by showing you here. This is the Sun Joe Pressure Washer. Now, this one does 2100 PSI. It's a plug-in, okay, and it's $139.98. <clears throat> now, we bought, and we're still working on the, uh, actually, the tool review video for the DeWalt one, which was also 2100 PSI that I bought at, at Home Depot. The DeWalt version of this is 249 and it's very similar. This one looks like it might be taller than the DeWalt, and you can also wheel this one around and store the the uh, sprayer wand there just like you can with the DeWalt unit. And I see some people are checking in. Teddy's in, Ted McDonald. Hey, Ricardo. What's up, Ricardo? And so, yeah, we're, this one is 139 compared to the 249 for DeWalt. I want to very quickly, since we're right here by the TVs, just show you a couple of TV deals that they've got going right now. So here you've got the LG Nano Cell. Now this is their more affordable line. This is not the OLED, which I love the OLED. I have the OLED. So this TV here, 86 inch, this is $1599. It's down $200 at the moment. And you know, it's pretty hard to go uh, to go wrong with any of the TVs you see in any of these stores. They're, they're all pretty good here. So you're seeing pretty much, you know, $200 savings across the board there when, you, when you're in the bigger TVs. Man, some of these, they have the volume way up. And here's, you got even Sony's getting in on it too. So you got some clearance prices. So if you're looking, you know, there's two different things. You can either get an instant savings or a clearance price. So come in and, you know, look for both. And let me get around the backside where it's a little more quiet and I can actually hear myself burp. All right, I'm not gonna bother with the smaller ones down there. There's, there's also some uh, sound bars that are for sale and that are discounted. So I wanted to show you there's some deals here on on some of these night owls. So this one is the eight, or is it the Arlo that's got the, there is a night owl over here, but I'm gonna show you the Arlo first. So this is their Pro 3 floodlight. This sort of competes with the ring floodlight. So this one's $40 off. Okay. And that's what it looks like right there. <clears throat> a lot smaller and kind of sleek, right? And let's see what else we got here. We have, here. here's the Night Owl that I said was being um, discounted right now. So they have an instant savings going on. This is their 10 camera system right here. And it's 4K. I wouldn't, I wouldn't even buy any security system that wasn't 4K. Forget, forget the uh, uh, high def. 4K is much better and much clearer. So here's your savings on there. So they took $100 off of this system. Now there's another smaller Night Owl next to it. It's an 8 channel that's $5.99. So you can see the, the difference in the, the price savings when you're getting these instant savings. So. You know why would you get this one when you have this one here and you get and it comes with 10 cameras now they're clearancing another night owl this is a three camera system I and mean, remember what i said see hd only 1080p um so this is if you just um you know it's like why even would you get this one because with only three cameras this thing is still at 439. See? now this store is out of them so they're only available online but why would you get this for $439 when you can get 10 cameras here for $499? I think this one's a much better deal. Even if you don't use all of them, throw them out, save them as a backup, sell the spare cameras online, whatever. <clears throat> okay, now you have your Garmin Approach. This is the S40 here, 50 bucks off. Shutching. And I. I don't see any signs here about the mattresses, but I know there is something going on. Let me see. Is it these? That's the base. So now you're getting $100 off of like the Serta base if you need the queen, the queen mattress base. And, but I don't see anything here about the mattresses, so it might only be online. So I would check that for sure. All right, now. 
see if we got anything else over there that catches our eye. Oh, we got the Simply Safe. I forgot about them. So, for some reason, they got them on the other side. Right. But is it Simply Safe or is it something else? The Netgear one. <coughs> yeah, there's your router right there. 60 bucks off. All right, I want to check out some tools while we're here. See what kind of new tools they got in or any deals. Here we go. So they still got this yard force for 369. Um, but here's the new one. This looks like a, a, a decent bargain here. So these are this is made by work. So this is their three-in-one combo kit. So you got the weed whacker there and the blower. And let's see, you also get the hedge trimmer. And you get two batteries, and you get the charger, all for 189. So if you're looking to, to really get some savings, this is probably the kit to get. <clears throat> I know they have a kit over um, at Costco right now, it's Greenworks, but I think it might just be the blower by itself. And I think it's 279 over there, so you can see what an incredible deal you're getting. Now, I doubt this is gonna be as powerful as as the Greenworks one, because usually when you get these things in a kit like this, they're not giving you the strongest one. And in fact, let me see if it says anything about the CFM on here. Uh, nothing. So when they don't even tell you what the CFM is, that means they're too ashamed, in my opinion. Okay, so here, here's the one out of the box, the Sun Joe pressure washer we just showed you. So here's the second spot, second display that they have of this here. So 139 and you, and you get these two brushes with it. Yeah, so uh, reasonably compact. The electrical winds up here and stores right there. The pressure hose winds up around the back and your wand just goes right here. See? Still haven't seen any deals on the Stanley vacuum here. This has been the same price for like two years. And here's the one that frustrates me the most is the channel lock set. It's still $89.98, man. The best price we ever saw on this was a one-day sale about two years ago, three years ago, where I bought this kit. And this is a great set. I got to tell you, even at $89, it's still a, a great deal. But I got it for $69 on a one-day sale. So anytime if you can score that at a lower price there, you know. And... WG says Jeff on another sick one. Hey, and Eddie, Eddie just checked in. Hello, Jeff. Good to see you. Leak Master Plumbing. Okay, so people always ask me about these. Uh, like, what's a good stud finder? These are good. I have, I have a feeling these. I don't know if these guys make them themselves or if they're made for them by Franklin. But I have the Franklin version of this one, the smaller one. And so I just bought these. I like this one because it's more compact than my older one. Um, I used to have one similar to this, but it was probably three or four inches longer. So what happens is when you wave this by the stud, the LEDs light up. So like two or three LEDs light up when you go by the studs. So yeah, 1998, you definitely can't go wrong on these. So I use a combination of these and my little magnets that I have that um i use the magnets to find where the screw was in the drywall because you wave the magnet around and it sticks right over the screw so it's a much more accurate method of finding if you can find where the screws are you know you're right smack dab in the middle of that stud okay then you have the skill um we've seen this here before this is that uh, four volt screwdriver with 42 pieces in the kit let me see if I can get it in a little bit of light with a, without as much glare. Sort of right there. So I've always loved their little drivers. I have one of their old little uh, uh, drivers that doubles as a cardboard slicer, which is an incredible tool. Probably one of my favorite tools in my whole collection. And so this is $29.98. And Land Shark says, I'm a stud and you found me. <laughs> I have this at home. I bought this in here a couple of years ago. I like it. 50 foot cord rail. It's 13 amp. 
Um, they do have another one. Uh, this is the Yellow Jacket Outdoor Extension Cord. So people are always asking me about extension cords when I go into do my live streams at Lowe's and Home Depot. So this one here, it's a hundred foot. It's a 12.3, so it only does 15 amps. If you're looking for something more, you're gonna have to spend bigger bucks and get like a um, a 10 gauge maybe. And so this one has the light that indicates the power's on, which is very handy to have. Can't tell you how many times I've had to drop my OPE equipment and then go back up to the fuse panel or whatever, or the timer to go, why isn't this thing on? But this is 56 bucks. They still got the leather gloves there, the two pack for 19. And where's, oh, so here's the clearance price on, this is funny. I just showed you these gloves last night at, at my live stream at Lowe's. Very similar price. Two pack of these mechanics. Mechanics wear. Right there. So these are a nice savings here. Ten bucks off. That's like pretty much 50%. You get your car mats. Um, I don't see any deals on the mobile one. Whenever you know an oil change is imminent in your future, you should start monitoring Sam's Club and Costco to see when these are going on sale. Because they do go on sale, they go on and off sale quite frequently. And actually, right now, they're doing on the on the tires, $120 off. On the, I think they're doing Pirelli this, no, they're doing Pirelli, Goodyear, and Goodrich. Next month, they'll switch off, just like Costco does, they'll switch off and do, uh, like, Michelin. So, and then, you know, a lot of people forget, too. Sam's Club has a boatload of restaurant-type stuff. So, like, you know, nice big old mixing bowls, giant stock pots. I can't tell you how many times I've had to come in here and buy these because spoons, forks, and knives disappear in our house, like, rapidly, guys. I don't know if you're aware of this. There's a black hole in the center of the universe that sucks all the spoons and forks out of people's houses. Okay, they may look friendly, friendly looking black holes, but don't be fooled by their, don't be deceived, okay? They're, they suck all the spoons and forks and other utensils out of your, your house, all of those missing things that disappear. Yeah, so they have a lot of these. And I, I've, I come in and buy like these guys here by huge amounts. Um, for doing when I'm dripping and stuff in the in the uh, barbecue grill, these come in handy. You know what I use these for sometimes if I can, if I'm ever doing working on leaks. And you look, you got your pre-measured for large volume stuff as well. So I want to come back down this way and. We're gonna come around and do we have an instant savings? We do. All right, I'm gonna come back. I got two people over there taking up the entire aisle, and everywhere I tried to turn, they got in front of me. It's like they know you're filming, and they just want to be jerks. So what I do is I leave them to their activity. All right, this is a good deal. I'm getting a bunch of these because you guys know I do all those tool, tool giveaways, right? Let me see how many of these I want. Oh, yeah. Oh. So these here, these are the uh, 25 packs of the 10 by 15. So any of you guys who've won my tool uh, reviews, you know, the tool giveaways, you've seen me ship you a lot of the tools in these, especially the, the Ryobi fans. And uh, I'm trying to figure what else I've, I've sent in these. But there's a number of the taller items that just fit perfectly in these. I don't even know what the price is because these aren't in the right place. I do know that the... That's, that's those. See, like, none, none of these is in the, the right spot. So it doesn't matter. I have to buy them. So I'm getting them anyway. I wanted to show you some of this outdoor stuff. So here we have a gazebo. And I don't know the price on the gazebo. Let's see if they get the sign right here. They do. So this one's a, actually it's a pergola. Yeah, because when you see these 
the crisscrossing wood, that's the pergolas. So this is a 14 by 10. And I believe that might be the number for it right there. This is like, it's like a hollow wood, nice wood. And inside here, actually they have this game, it's a seven piece dining set with a game table for $19.99. So I guess these are the chairs. <clears throat> And the one thing I don't like about like all the warehouse clubs, all they seem to sell is wicker, wicker, wicker. I'm just fed up with wicker. Never liked it as a kid. I don't like it now. I'm a cranky old guy, and I still hate wicker. I mean, come on, who wants to sit on this? But yeah, some people don't mind, I guess. All right, but so they got this game table that looks kind of like shuffleboard. And let me see. And I guess this is the table, the dining room table here. So it probably just slides over it or something yeah and yeah so that's two grand this dining set here is $21.99 and it comes with two four six chairs wicker of course the table itself is nice and it has a fire pit in the middle okay and then you have a gazebo I love this gazebo because look it's got a metal roof this is what we call like a Key West style metal roof so that should be uh, pretty good in the rain. And again, you got the, the wood here, and I'll take you up inside here. You can see how the, the interior looks like on the roof. Very well structured there. I don't know how well it's, it supports the winds and everything. I guess if they're selling it here, that we're probably hurricane certified. I personally would like to see the NOAA documents, the NOA documents. Because otherwise your insurance company might just have a fit and go, hey, <laughs> you put that thing up, we're not covering you. I know a lot of them will, will cancel your entire coverage if they find out you have a trampoline. And if you have a screened-in patio, they won't cover that either. So here's your gazebo. It's a cedar with a hip roof gable on there. Hip gable roof. I believe that's the part number there. So $17.99. These... Dudes, these were like 1400 not too long ago. And good, Greg says, good morning from Wichita, Kansas. Howie says, spiders like to hide in that wicker. Ooh, that makes it even scary. I know, I, I know some women that are just totally freaking out over spiders, and they would just not want that. Uh, here's another one here, $25.99. This is a little bit classier looking. I like this design right here. And this here's your fire pit in the middle. Uh, here's an elevated one that's rounded, and it's like you know, if I'm gonna sit outside on that stuff, I want a I want a cushion chair. You know what? I don't see a single, only one. This is the only cushion chair I see out of all their outdoor stuff here. So I don't know. This year I, I'm just not as impressed as some of the previous stuff they've had. Costco generally I think has better outdoor furniture. So this set is $19.99. Also with a fire pit in the middle. Nice, nice uh, wood grain look there. Spiders have rights also? Never, never. This is a, uh, a nicer one because at least where your butt is, there's a cushion. And they have what they call the welting. That's where you see that big cord that goes around. And I like these weltings because it gives it a little bit more of, of a firmer seat. So that's what you want to look for outside. You don't ever want to get those ones that show just the curved pillow type thing because they're, they're, they're going to mash down on you. They're not going to support you very well. So this is good. Look, they have a, a hole for the pole in the middle. No fire pit on this one. I like, I'm going to come around and show you this bar. Here, I'll, let me show you from both ends. This bar does look nice, but again, uncomfortable wicker. <clears throat> Y'all can have the wicker. I'm all wickered out. So $21.99 for this bar. It does look nice though. As far as wicker goes, this looks nice. This does have sort of a tropical look to it. <clears throat> all right, now I wanna show you some of the, uh, like the outdoor storage and, and stuff here. This, I don't know, is this the key to one? This is the, the deck box. Yeah, the, the, I'm sorry, Keter. I always get corrected by my friends from Israel where Keter is made. It's actually pronounced Keter. Uh, but these guys make, the same company that makes this, 
makes the DeWalt Tough System 2.0 boxes, the rigid tool boxes in the Milwaukee, and possibly others. I suspect that they make the Craftsman uh, trade stack as well. So this is a, a nice big box. 169 for this one. And then, I don't like Adirondack chairs, but they always have them here at Sam's and and at Costco, and Ketter seems to be a real big manufacturer of these as well. <clears throat> so how many of you knew that all the time you come in here and you see all of these, it's the same company that makes those toolboxes? And I love this bench. This is a Hudson storage bench, 60 gallon. So this one here is 129, and who just checked in? Stan just checked in. Good morning from Chicago. I wish we had your weather this morning, man. I want some nice, cool weather today. And here's a 30-gallon Keter box. Ket oh, sorry, Keter. Excuse me. This one's 30 gallons here. And yeah, that's 44.98. And then is this the one? This is a 165-gallon one. For 119, I don't know if it's uh, this one's a little smaller than the one I just showed you over there, uh, but I like the design on this one better. It kind of looks like it's real wood, and, and I like how they do the two tone here. And here's the inside. Bada bing, bada boom. So you can store some nice stuff there. That's what they show on the box. Okay. Uh, of course, you got your landscape fabric, uh, four feet by 225 feet. These rolls of it are $32.98. And I gotta show you this bargain right here, man. Uh, where is it? They got a Nordic here. This is a Nordic bike. They already had them on uh, clearance, right? And they didn't do a good job of like writing up the sign. I, I barely noticed it, yeah? It says last one, $1,000. So they had, this thing was originally $1,600. They took $400 off and made it $1,199. And then dropped it down to a thousand bucks for this last one on the display. This is the time that when you find bargains like that, you come in after Christmas when they're done selling all these. And man, there was so much immense competition this year because Sam's Club had like four or five bikes, um, Costco had four or five bikes, Lowe's tried getting into it and failed miserably. They ended up totally clearancing those things out. You have this Lasco pivoting utility fan. This is great if you have a, a leak on your floor and you want to just leave it on drying it. Now, Costco has a smaller, cheaper version uh, for $59 if you're looking to save some cash. And I, I never understand why they keep bringing these things in here because they never really sell them. I don't know. Maybe uh, on clearance they do. Right, so here we got a wood look elevated garden bed right here for $109. That's cool. And then you got a shelf down below. Um, oh, yeah. So we have these, the eco borders. These are the, I've used these, and I have these on my house too. Um, these are, are $7.98 for a four foot section. And these are made out of recycled tires. What do we have for hose? We have $31 for 120 feet right there what size is that hose uh, what size five eighths <clears throat> that's as small as you really want to go if you want to have decent pressure I uh, wanted to show you we got finally in the red rubber mulch for those of you who buy this and the price pretty much stayed the same we got lucky there I usually pick up three or four bags a year just to kind of fill in areas where I was lacking some and Mike Newsom checked in on the chat and he says, what's up, Jeff? Well, what's up is the price on the fertilizer now. If you notice, look at this, it's almost 60 bucks. And I gotta imagine that if that's the price here, it's gonna be worse at Home Depot and Lowe's. Uh, normally, I've, I used to come into Sam's here and pay 49. That's what I paid last year, 49 bucks. Okay, the bonus S. The weed and feed, okay? Last year it was 49. Now it didn't go up too much. 
but the Green Max certainly did. Uh, we got these five LED solar path lights right here. These are 1698. Yeah, so these are being marked down three bucks. Oh man, I think my belly just gained weight looking at that. I'm gonna walk down here to find some uh, barbecue stuff. We're heading down towards barbecue land. And we're going to see what we've got. Do some spot checks on that. And sometimes they put some of the appliance deals down this aisle too. This is an interesting one. I might, I'm thinking of picking this up. So this is 50 bucks. So this is the Therm Pro Ultimate Barbecue Thermometer Bundle. So this is like your Thermapen right here. And I like that nice thin pen there. Don't buy the Taylor one at Costco. I broke it just opening the freaking thing. I, I, stupid. So this, you got your Thermapen, which is great. And then here, what, what these do is you plug your probe into the food, like if you're cooking a turkey, and it transmits it wirelessly. Tells you all everything you want to know. Two probes. One is usually giving you the temperature of inside the oven at the surface or the grill. And the other one is telling you the temperature of the meat. So I'm going to try this one out. I'm always, you know, practicing and experimenting with that kind of thing. And let's see. Batman says, good morning, Jeff. I joined Sam's a few years back when buying a smoke hollow smoker was the lowest price anywhere. Yep. And when these things do go on sale, they're even better priced, okay? So here's a griddle. This is a, a Pro Series 5 burner gas griddle. And this one is $3.99. Right there. They have another one that's a smaller one. It's a four burner griddle. And this one's $2.29. And let's do a spot check on some of the now, I don't ever use this stuff, the charcoal. If I do ever smoke out there, it's it's with real wood. But anyway, here's your Kingsford deer. So, hey, let us know if you how much you guys pay for this uh, in your area. So this is two 20-pound bags. So you got 40 pounds total for $21.48. And the match light charcoal is two 16 pounds for $22.88. And then we have the hardwood. This is the lump charcoal. This would be the stuff I would use if I, you know, go that route. So, twenty-one ninety-eight. That's a thirty-pound bag, all natural. So they claim. Okay, do we have any instant savings here? On oh, the Power XL Grill Fryer Combo, twelve and one. So this one right here is. Let me see. What are we? What are we getting in savings on this guy? We are getting fifty dollars off on this one. Rusty says, "Can I bring my dog in there, like Home Depot?" Hey, good question. I can't remember if I've seen anybody in here with a with a dog before. I would imagine if it's a service dog, they're not going to stop you. And I don't know if there's laws that protect you about that. I know with condos, if you have a service animal, I think they have to let you move in. So, let me bring this back out. Uh, so it doesn't shake all over the place. And you know, they always have like arts and stuff like that. Little kits here. Little paint kits. You know, come here first before you go to Michael's and check the price. Because I know Michael's is like real expensive. Because I've had to buy kits for my girls before. Wanted to show you. Uh, and they, are they doing any deals on the folding tables? No, they're all still uh, same price. They did get in, uh, this is new here. This is the kids' hutch and chair. So I've had to buy desks before for my kids. That's perfect for them. And a kids' explorer chair, this is really nice. Good size. And this is kind of cool here. The kids' explorer sofa, 189. Just got this one in. And I wanted to come back around and show you the, those Dyson Vacs. Because one of them, and we, the signal might get really weak. It's usually weak right here in this aisle. 
Um, this no, it wasn't Dyson. It was on the Shark. So forty dollars off on the Ultralight Pet Vacuum. So that's this guy right here, which is this guy right here. And let me see if they did anything else down this aisle that is on sale. Nada. None of the mixers, nothing. So they got some flags in. I wanted to show you these because these flags are like very premium right here in this flag kit. Because it's not just printed on. These are the real deal, folks. These are like embroidered right there. See that? So really classy. It's got the ball on the end. And um, these are popular with people that do like homeschooling or nurseries and stuff like that. This is that multi-purpose flooring, the, the reversible mats. So you get quite a few in, in here for 32 bucks. And they also have black. We've come in here before. I've bought um, mats for outside our church that you can put down, like just doormats. Like really cheap. <clears throat> so don't forget that they have those things as well. Let me see what else we got. Um, these... I was trying to find if they had any um, first watch. It's a local restaurant that we have, but I don't see any here. But whenever you see these bigger ones here, these are the ones you want to get. <clears throat> because you're getting here, for example, $120 worth for $99. Bucks. So these are the ones that are worth getting. The little cards like these are, are a joke. So, like, here's your Ulta Beauty, for example. All right, $47.98. Ooh, I'm saving the whole whopping two bucks. Or is it more than that? Oh, this one's more, actually. This one's a little better. Because here you're getting $55 worth of cards for $47.98. So if you have a wife or kids or, or even your daughter's birthday's coming up and you want to buy a couple of these, this, this one's okay. Some of these are okay. So Landry's, if you guys know uh, Tillman for Tito, they show him on CNBC a lot. These are all of his restaurants. Bubba Gum Shrimp, of course, is one of them. Morton's. So all of these here, you're getting for $100, <clears throat> you're getting $100 worth of restaurant for 80 bucks. So if you know you're going to be eating there, you stop in here and see them on the way over and you save yourself 20% right off the bat. Uh, the Outback ones, you're saving $15, which is pretty good. Uh, same thing, Golden Corral. Look at this, 50 bucks. You're paying $37.50. So these are sort of okay. Not as massively huge as some of the, these here. Uh, you know, we don't even really have many Boston chickens around us. Most of them are closed. But you're saving 20 bucks, or 20, is that 20 bucks? 20%. Now, when you come around to these, to, to the gift card center, these are mostly a joke. It's like, you know, why even bother? Uh, all right, so you're getting, you're getting $45 worth of Applebee's for $42.98. Ooh, going to Disney World on that savings, folks. <laughs> yeah, it's 86 today in San Antonio. Dang, Mike, you're in a heat wave already. Uh, most of these others, same thing, you know, like the Starbucks, you're only saving two bucks. But if you know somebody or, you know, maybe you yourself spend hundreds of dollars a month, or should I say waste hundreds of dollars a month in, in uh, Starbucks buying $10 uh, coffees, uh, then, you know, yeah, save a couple of bucks here and there every, every once in a while, right? Let's see if they have anything here with the computers. I don't see any price discounts on the computers. Costco really knocks it out of the park compared to a lot of the other folks when it comes to the computers. So, yeah. So here's one here. They got an Acer. Um, this is a uh, only HD. It's a 1080. But here you, you got 70 bucks off on this one. And anything on... What are we having a clearance price over here? Another clearance, Clarence. You got the Rossi Home Media Tray. Well, that's only a $5 savings. I've got one like that. Those are kind of cool. But yeah, really nothing, nothing that matches what Costco does. 
Um, we got a smart hub here. Get seventy dollars off down to one ninety nine. And I saw something else over here. Instant savings. You know they're always doing savings on these kinds of things here. These uh, ion projector speaker things. And this is down sixty bucks. Wow. So. Rusty says, I need a computer. What do you think? Well, you don't want to ask me because I spent 10 grand on a massive system last September where I handpicked everything from the processor. It was a multi-threaded um, AMD, that, that Ryzen thread, what do they call it, thread ripper? Because I'm, all of the videos that I do, I need, I need something that has an immense power. So, such immense that I, I, like I had to choose special fans and power supplies for it and everything is all solid state memory i would not get anything that has a hard drive in it anymore I, to me i've banned hard drives i lost two seagate fire cuda drives last year and, and a lot of videos and stuff and it was devastating to me and i, I i'm not going to allow that again i'm never going to buy another seagate hard drive whatever you buy make sure it does not have a seagate drive and i cannot stress that um, the importance of that after after mine failed and I started doing more research and looked at the graphs of who has failures meantime between failures Seagate drives are at the top they're the worst and I was very surprised to find that out because they were such a well-known name in the engineering you know I'm a former electrical engineer myself and I, I just it just blew my mind how how high their their failure rate is but if you're just a regular person looking for a computer you can go into Costco and, and just get the biggest tower you can get. Or if you don't like the power that's in there, you get it online from Costco. Because sometimes their, their, their better systems aren't always in the store. So here you got the new Ninja Foodie. It's 50 bucks off. Yeah, so if you're looking for a budget computer, yeah, um, just do it when, when they're doing savings. A lot of times I see their big savings happen and like around September, October, and also around Black Friday time frame, when you see all those TVs start flying down to like super low prices, the computers are doing the same thing. If you go back and look at some of my streams from November and October and Costco, you'll see massive savings in there. So here's the other Ninja, the XL grill, $30 off. Air fries up to 75% less fat. Yeah, yeah, 10,000 was a lot, but believe me, it was worth it. The, the, I think the CPU alone, that chip, that special chip that I bought was probably 1,500 bucks of that cost. Yeah, that's a very specified, uh, specific machine that I got, but I gotta tell you, I'm extremely happy with it. And in that machine, I have three solid state drives there's no spinning hard drives it's all chips and the let's see the, i think the operating system is on a one terabyte um solid state drive so it's going to be as fast as you could possibly get it and only the operating system is on the c drive the other two drives are eight terabyte drives i like this man the stuffed waffleizer 20 bucks off, man. That's a massive steep savings right there. And by the way, my computer puts out a lot of heat, too. Now, those of you who are gamers, you already know what I'm talking about. My, my brother-in-law and his son, they have a, a few computers all networked together, like gaming in their house. There's this one room. My sister says they can't get the temperature down. They put the AC up as high as it goes because you're supposed to have it pretty cold in there. And they can't get it cold enough to keep this, these computers cooled down. And sometimes they overheat. Look at this. 30 bucks on your Keurig Duo Brewer. Down to 129.98. And what do we have here? This is their K Supreme. The 30. Same thing. 30 bucks off. And nothing on the KitchenAid. I was surprised that they didn't have anything uh, on these. But you know what? When Costco does these, their kit is better than the kit here. And I'll tell you why. This is a five-quart kit here. 
the one that they do at Costco is a six quart kit. And when Costco puts it on sale, usually every other month it's like a roller coaster. The Costco price ends up down into the mid twos, sometimes into the low twos. So keep your eye on that. If you're thinking of getting one of these, um, I'm sure there's nothing wrong with this kit at all. But I'm just saying it's a bigger, better one, I think, at Costco. And a lot of people always ask about, like, hey, what do you have for, like, oh, that's, yeah, that's just a regular little fridge. I was looking for, I don't see it here. They've, they've had here in the past the little wine refrigerators, but I don't see it here on the aisle today. They might have gotten uh, all bought up. And then uh, we don't see the price on this guy. I know we've shown it before, but I like that storage unit right there. But they just have no price on it. So I don't know how people, they might not have any left because they don't have the cars. Yeah, currently out of stock. And then you have these big industrial shelves right here. Let me see what we got here. There's the Seville Classic here. Um, I'm gonna show you in a second. They don't have one set up. But this is that Seville Classic. This is $4.99. It's a rolling workbench. So it looks very similar to the, uh, the Titan. Is it Titan or Triton that they sell over at Costco? That I just showed you the other day at $5.99 over there. And these shelves, they don't have a price on these shelves, by the way. So I don't know why. Unless, let me see. Is there another sticker? Nope, nothing. So something's going on here where there's no pricing. Here's your five-level storage rack here. Good. What? No, those are, that's not metal. There's like a, I don't know, some kind of a fiber board on there. That's $69 for that one. And then you got $114 for this six-tier shelving right here. And don't forget, like I pointed out at, um, at Costco, get your filters here. You know, look, so they got four filters here for $42. Bucks. Costco usually sells them in three packs for like $30 some odd dollars. And a lot of times I'll come in here or Costco to get the smoke alarms. And they are always running deals on the smoke alarms. Sometimes they'll pick like a product safety month and they'll start making them uh, like dirt cheap. And you got all the LED light bulbs here. So what do we got? We got instant savings on the GE Daylight LED A19s. Boom. So I like these that they have here. And then look, you got these that replace some of the little uh, floods. And it's, and it's, is this a real LED? Yeah, it is, yeah. So get your candelabra lights. These are hard to find sometimes. Sometimes you go into Home Depot and you stand around and look and look and you can't find them. Delta, they're selling at the same price as Costco, 179 right? But Costco runs their fa their faucet on sale for like 149 or 139 every once in a while every few months it just rotates on and off so they got flooring here too we bought i don't see the one we bought from my friend's house when we did my friend jamie's um pano yeah this was it silver oak this is the one we bought they still have it here wow two years ago we came and got this and we we did his little one bedroom condo over in Fort Lauderdale with it right before he sold it. And he got maximum bucks just by putting it in there. And Rusty says, I just paid 50 bucks for a smoke alarm with carbon dioxide. Yeah, it's good to have the carbon dioxide. Um, especially put one in the garage, too. So if you ever get any leaks there. And Landshark says, come to San Antonio. I'll drive you around all the stores. That would be cool to do sometime. I used to live there for three years when I was a kid. And I still, I got sisters that live in Austin and Houston. And I haven't been out there in eons. They usually come this way. But yeah, one of these days I wanted to um, take the kids out there, go uh, along the riverfront there. Wait, do we have anything worthwhile? Okay, so you see this right here? These are the plastic, oh, this is only a four tier, 59 bucks. Uh, usually Home Depot and Lowe's sell things like these for about 80 bucks. Okay. And let's see if we've got anything else worthwhile down here. Sometimes the microfiber cloths, I don't know if they have them here. I usually buy mine at, uh, Costco. Here you go. 36 microfiber towels. 
pretty much around the same price range. There's 17 at Costco, but they put them on sale for 13. And when they do, that's when I buy them. And of course you got all your shop towels, right? Here's, here's like one of those rugs I was telling you about. Well, this is an anti-microbial mat. I think this is very similar to what I got for putting outside the, the church door. So, do you remember last year, guys, when if you, were, if you found one of these, it was like gold? <laughs> we used to pose and put pictures up on Facebook. Look what I found. Oh, man. Ah, oh, the good old days. Yep. Okay, so normally I don't cover the food, but I want to go over and show, uh, see what pricing they have on the prime grade steaks. So if you've ever walked into like Costco or Sam's and you've seen prime grade and you wonder, well, what is that? What does that mean? Why is it, why are they charging so much more? So those are the pretty much the top 5% of the steak in the whole country. And it's typically in years past, it was, you had only the steak houses, the, the fancy steak houses would get them and also um, you know some of the big hotels and all that and then when the economy took a nosedive in 2008 suddenly we started seeing it at Costco and then here and uh, they finally got it here at, at Sam's Club I think about a year or two ago but normally when you look at a steak a prime grade steak like these you see all that marbling right in there that's how you tell that you're looking at a really good steak. If you just pull up a steak and all you see is just solid red, it's probably gonna cook tough and it's not gonna render nicely. So all of that, that, that marble fat in there renders nicely when you cook and it gives it a lot better flavor and it's much more tender, but it's also a lot more money. Let me see what they're getting per pound here. Yeah, see, 19.98 a pound, you see that? When we had that economic downturn in 2009, I was jumping out of my socks at Costco, running in there to buy prime grade steak at $10.99 a pound. I could not believe it because here our regular stores like Publix were selling the steaks for $9.95 a pound, just regular, regular USDA choice, right? So, to, to, um, but the price has gone up all over the years, but it's still not a bad deal. I don't always buy it, I buy it on, on a splurge. You buy two, I, you know, you, you, you buy two of these ribeyes here and you can cook that'll handle four people easily in the family and then um, they always have really good selections here of like the pre-cooked shrimp see these guys here and they do the the crabs and stuff but i gotta warn you one thing i gotta warn you about especially at costco when you see like those lobster tails lined up in a package watch out for the for looking on there and, and see if it says previously frozen so I don't know if I see it any, I don't see it really on here. But when, when something says previously frozen, that means, well, oh, that, that there's not much taste for whatever reason. I don't know why. And I always buy like the salmon and stuff here like these. I try to find the ones that are from Norway, Atlantic. You know, the ones that meet the standards there. And they usually have your sockeye. You can get tilapia, but what I like is that sometimes you come in here, you can, you can get cod, and what is this, the uh, snapper, see I like snapper too, and mahi-mahi, like most people don't normally see that in the regular grocery stores, uh, monkfish sometimes we see, I usually come in and buy like these things here, the smoked salmon, and put them on the bagels, it's got to go with the bagels, darlings, so there you have it. And I think that's pretty much everything. Um, and, and you know, also don't overlook the wines because the wines are much better priced here. And they just have so many shirts. Every time I come in, I'm always looking at shirts. Do they have any decent ones? You know, it's only stuff for the little kitties. You can get much better deals here than you would at like, like some of the retail stores uh, buying the stuff for the kids. And yeah, they're, they're bringing in some new items now, but yeah, every now and then they bring in like the, the Guy Harvey shirts. That's when I buy them here. Why, why pay 50 bucks in a retail store when you can get a decent Guy Harvey shirt every once in a while in here for like 15 bucks? That's what I say. All right, so listen, I'm gonna check out now. Uh, so yeah, the reason I came in here was because the, my tires, 
I had to order a couple of tires a week and a half ago because my belts were poking through on the rear tires. I was like shocked. I'm like, oh. So the Lord preserved me. Thank you, Lord, for driving me around in the last two weeks and my tires didn't blow on me. Here's some of these other shirts. These are like the fishing shirts and stuff that they carry here. And of course, the big play set here, the, the swing set. So the swing set is $1598. So the price has gone up on these in the last couple of years. These used to be like $1200, $1300 price range, you know. And you can always find an eclectic mix of stuff here like the pinball machines. Uh, a lot of the heaters now, they're starting to discount them heavily because of spring coming. Not so many people want heaters right now. It's already 80 degrees outside. Sometimes you find these safes. Oh yeah, the Duraflames. Oh, look at this clearance on these guys too now, right? So I forgot to show you these earlier. And then you got the quick start Duraflames. These are the fire starters. These are also on clearance. Yeah, because they're starting to bring in more of the, the summer fun stuff. You're going to see more of these things, like the floating pools and all of that. And they still have a lot of the weight equipment left over from uh, Christmas time. I love these, the Joe Wider weight set right here. Man. So the Legends Pinball, how much was that thing? Did they have the sign on there? I didn't see it. They got them stacked up right here, but I don't see the sign. I don't know. They're missing quite a few signs today. I think they're just moving stuff around. Is this it here? Oh, yeah. $6.99. Woof. That is, like, way up there. Because, first of all, this isn't even a full-size thing. This is, like, a little, a little guy here. I liked it when they had the Pac-Man machines in here a couple of years ago. They were around $400. All right. So, there you go, folks. That's what we have at Sam's Club today. So thank you all for joining us. If you have any questions, ask them down in the comments below when the video loads up in a few minutes, and we'll answer them as soon as we get back today. So you all have a great day, great productive day. Happy shopping. Look at our live streams and our other uh, great deals that we've posted over the past week, and we will see you all on the next one.